smoked and fried chicken. We're gonna cook a whole chicken today. We're gonna spatchcock it, or simply put, take the backbone out, and we're going to smoke it for an hour and a half to two hours on the pit barrel cooker. Then we're gonna break out the plow disc and do a deep fry to get some crispy skin. And while this chicken is smoking, let's make a sauce recipe that I saw on the internet called Awesome Sauce. This chicken weighs just over four pounds. First thing I'm gonna do is cut this backbone out. Then we got a little stuff here that I don't really care to eat. Just gonna kinda wipe that out. Just turn this guy over. There we go. It's all flat. Now I've just got some spray olive oil. I usually like to use duck fat. I don't have any right now. And I'm just using this olive oil as a binder. I use your favorite chicken rub. Today I'm using some uh, this uh, rub smoke. Oh, rub some chicken. Uh, but I would suggest this: use something that's low in sugar, because eventually we are going to fry this guy, and uh, you don't want that sugar to burn all up. Now for some color and some flavor, I'm going to use a little of this Everglades fish and chicken rub in behind it. Now, if anybody's watched my channel for any length of time, you know I love this rub. They don't pay me to say it. I don't get paid if you buy it. I'm just telling you I like it. Now let's turn this chicken over. Now we're just going to do the same thing on this side. You might want to lift these wings up. So you can get under them, get the good flavor all over everything. And then again, come back on this side with that Everglades fish and chicken. You can see how it gives it that nice little red color to it. And now our chicken seasoned. going to be using grape wood to get the smoke on it. So we're going to smoke this chicken today in our pit barrel cooker. Let's get our bar back in. And get the lid on. Just three ingredients. Sweet Baby Ray sweet teriyaki, some Louisiana hot sauce, and honey mustard dressing. Now we want about a third of each. So there's a third of that one. Now put in a third of that teriyaki, maybe a little more. In fact, we're gonna go closer to halves. All right, what I'm going to do is put this in a bowl Got a little bit more hot sauce than what I saw the recipe uh, calls for. That's a little easier to stir up. So what I'm going to do is add back in a little bit more honey mustard. You want equal parts. Maybe just a little bit more teriyaki sauce. Okay, let's give this a taste. Ooh, sweet. A little spicy? I see why it's called awesome sauce. It's been two hours and it turned cold here, but we're gonna check on this chicken. I'm just gonna get the lid off. Look at the collar of that chicken, will you? Now, a lot of people ask me what temperature the pit barrel was at. I, I never check it. Uh, my pit barrel usually runs around 275-ish, especially if I just light a small section of the charcoal like we did today. Let's do a quick temp check on it. You can see there we're about 151, almost 152. We want to go to 165, but we're still going to fry it. So I'm going to get this fryer ready. It won't take that oil long to heat up. We 
going to get our chicken out of here and get it over to the oil. Check our oil temp. We want to be around 325. See, we're at 330. We'll drop that chicken in there. The temperature will drop when we put it in. It's probably been about three to four minutes. We're going to turn it over. We'll have a look at the other side. Look at that beautiful collar. Just look at that collar. I think we're going to turn it over one more time just to get this just a little bit darker, not too much. Then we'll get this chicken off here. There's our smoked and fried chicken. I'm going to take it back on the patio, let it rest about 15 minutes, prep it for the taste test. Now to finish this chicken off, I want to come in with that little bit of that awesome sauce we made. You know that's going to be good. And then this little parsley. I grew my own parsley. Kind of proud of that, although it's not that hard. And there it is, smoked and fried whole chicken. Can't wait to give it a taste. What do you think? Look at that. I think it's just going to come right off like so. Look at that. There's our chicken wing. In fact, we might even start with the wing, huh? It's been a super weird day here in Florida. It started out, it was just a little cool, but then it got cold and it just started blowing this like mist. Let's get back to the chicken. I got one of those legs here. I mean wing. It's definitely got a little crispy crunch on the skin and that awesome sauce. It's actually awesome. <laughs> it's got a little spice on it and we did exactly what we wanted. We got the smoke, we got the crispy. Hey, I've got a couple more chicken videos right down below.